Hello, I'm Gordon Stone, and what a blessing and a privilege and an honor it is to serve as your mayor. It's especially exciting to be your mayor during this special time of year, November and December, throughout our country. Special opportunities for us to appreciate the many blessings we have. Opportunities for us to spend time with our friends, get to know our neighbors even better, spend time with our family. It is a special time, and we hope that you will make plans to do that this season. In the meantime, we want to let you know about some really important things that we're doing in Pike Road, and nothing more important than what we do to celebrate the freedom we have in this country and to recognize those who have made that freedom possible. We have a very special veterans program that we do the Sunday before Veterans Day, and this year, November 7th, 2 p.m. at the Veterans Memorial right next to Founders Station at the corner of Wallahatchie and Pike Road where where Meriwether meets. It is, a, it is a special time. We have the Capitol Sounds providing great music. We have the opportunity to uh, have a walk of honor for our veterans and to reveal the bricks that people have chosen to recognize and have the opportunity to identify those special veterans in their lives. And this year, we have a really, really, really special blessing and treat because General Hecker, the commander out at Maxwell, is going to join us and be our keynote speaker. What a treat it is for us us to know that General Hecker has chosen to be a part of our Pike Road celebration. We appreciate that. We also have other many activities that you can be a part of, and we encourage you to go to pikeroad.us. Check out our website. You can find out about every one of these wonderful programs that are so much a part of our quality of life here and a part of our enhanced committee. We want to ask you to take a few minutes and check out the Arts Council specifically. They continue to do something all the time. They're in the middle right now of their Christmas tree auction where they, where they provide opportunities for you to buy a Christmas tree as a decoration for your home. They're, they're not the big tree. They're the special little trees that you can put in unique places. But the cool thing about this is all the proceeds go to help the local food pantry at Woodland Methodist Church. So please do what you can to go by the Arts Council. We also know that they have an art talk on November 14th. Another chance to meet your neighbors and celebrate the artistic talent in Pike Road. Now, November 15th, we continue with our series of Mondays with the Mayor. And we'll have the opportunity to celebrate with our great friends at Home Depot they need to have a double dose of thank you, though, because they are so gracious every year to help us do the improvements and, and refresh everything for the Veterans Celebration. And we want to go and thank them on November 15th. Now, of course, we'll continue to provide an opportunity for you to ask your questions and you to text in your questions because one of our goals is to be the most connected community in Alabama. That's why we do these videos. That's why we do the weekly newsletters and we do the monthly uh, radio show where you can call in and ask your questions. We want to be available, so don't hesitate to participate. Now, as we go forward, remember we have our Christmas tree lighting, and that is so much fun. It'll be that first Friday in December. We hope you'll join us. It'll be a, an opportunity for you to enjoy some of the wonderful talent and our young people who are going to be a part of it, and we'll share a story. We'll light the tree, probably have a little hot chocolate and other fun surprises. So make sure you put that on your calendar. It'll be that early afternoon, just as it begins to get dark, right at dusk. So make sure you are a part of that, and it's at Town Hall. We know that you have many other things that are going on. Our, our athletic teams are continuing to compete for, for uh, that next level, going into playoffs. We're so excited about what our school teams and our young people are doing throughout our community. We appreciate what our teachers and all of our administrators have done to get us through this season. We, we recognize COVID is still around, and we know that we're going to continue to be safe and to be smart and to build confidence with the decisions we make. Just remember, personal responsibility is the key. If you haven't been vaccinated and, and you want to explore that, please do, because there are options are all over at your local medical providers. But we want to encourage you to continue to help us all fight this battle and continue to, to get everything we can out of the way so we have every bit of normalcy in our wonderful hometown community of Pike Road. Finally, we want to make sure you know that the hay bales will be up through this weekend and we hope you'll go take one last look. 54 hay bales, wonderful, wonderful community engagement. Thank you so very much for making that a special part of our fall. Couldn't do any of this without the great support of our council. Thank you to our Pike Road team. We have so many things going on. I'm so proud to be a part of all of this. It is so much fun. Pike Road, we'll continue to pray for you, and we ask that you pray for each other.